Yeah, well, we actually moved a little further into town because we started to see that smoke really shift with some of the winds we're seeing here in Indiana. And if you stand a little too long around the plant, those fumes will instantly give you a headache. So BP did lift that evacuation order just after four o'clock. But since then, you've seen this entire town really just overtaken by smoke all across the area. The city says it's taking every precaution needed right now to keep people safe. Massive flames taking over Whiting, Indiana, stemming from a power outage at the BP refinery. Roads have been shut down around Indianapolis Boulevard as we saw crowds of employees evacuating the plant. People living on this street right behind the plant say they're used to this kind of stuff, but today's incident is a little more worrisome as they see how the amount of smoke and flames have spread. I've seen the workers evacuate, and that was my first concern, obviously public safety in the community. So. Um, Definitely a little odd. The black smoke started to get pretty heavy. City officials say crews had to burn additional product as a safety measure. So all of this is a normal process out of precaution during an event like this. Chopper 7 video shows the range of that smoke extending across the area. This type of incident has a wide ranging impact across the community, specifically when it comes to gas prices. Gas Buddies Patrick DeHaan says this refinery produces 440,000 barrels of oil per day. So this incident will likely hike gas prices by about 10 to 20 cents starting today. I think for now, gas prices could jump by 15 to maybe 30 cents a gallon here over the next couple of days. This refinery produces nearly 10 million gallons of gasoline every single day. So with this refinery basically now down for the count not producing, it's going to be a very swift and quick impact to the price that you pay at the pump. Meanwhile, there has been some other recent concerns with the BP refinery as a leak recently caused a natural gas smell all across the southern suburbs. The state of Indiana is holding a hearing next week for the public to weigh in on BP's application for continuing its air permit. So even though that evacuation order has been lifted, the road closures are still in place all around Indianapolis Boulevard, pretty much from 119 to 129th Street. As of now, BP has not said how long this shutdown will last. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.